Hey everyone, Gary Kramer here from Rise Academy. Um, coming to you from this little place I'm staying at in San Diego, California, about a week before I head back to Bali. Well, somebody very special with me here today <laughs> who's going to be sharing her story with us. Um, so let me set the stage here a little bit for you. Um, if you're familiar with the Mentor Me program, I wanted to prove that anyone can be mentored. <laughs> And this young woman here is sort of the poster child of that test. So, and you'll see what I mean. Um, I've mentioned her a couple times in, in different Q and A's and different places. I've had a video out there where I talked about her, sort of as an inspirational story. But before I released the Mentor Me program, I wanted to make sure that I wanted to prove the power of mentoring, the power of having someone believe in you um, and to show how when one person believes in you, it can lead to another person believing in you and another person and another person. Before long, you are a true success. And I, I do believe that Gigi was the perfect challenge. Now, to give you a little backstory on Gigi, she was a 20-year-old struggling student. Um, she's never made any money online before. She was a complete newbie. Um, she didn't know what FTP was. She didn't know what, what uh, HTML was. She didn't know any of this stuff. Uh, in fact, not only has she never made any money online, she's never made any money at all. She's living at home. Her mom is taking care of her. She lives with her cousin as well. Between them, her cousin has a job working at a, a San Diego fish taco <laughs> place down on the beach. Um, and her mom is unemployed. Her mom stays home and takes care of her. You might wonder, like, why would the mom stay home to take care of a 23-year-old, 22, now 23-year-old girl? Uh, it's because she has a disability. Um, she has what's called cerebral palsy. And uh, there was some brain damage at, at birth. At the time of birth, uh, part of her brain was damaged. And it affects her ability to walk. And it affects her uh, ability to speak, too, as you'll see here through this interview. Um, she struggles with things that normal people take for, for, for granted. So I'm going to just list off some of her challenges that many of you probably don't even have to deal with. She had no money. I mean, she had no money for Rise Academy program. She had no money for ad spend. No money at all. They're living off of like a couple thousand dollars a month. But she also has a disability. Also, English is not her first language. So she struggles a little bit with English, even, you know, grammar and stuff so to write ad copy. But again, you know, she is still intelligent. So, but when I, when I interviewed her and I talked to her, I, I realized that if I can, that would speak volumes for mentoring. She also had these built-in limiting beliefs. Um, but more importantly, I think because of her disability, I, I had a talk with her and she was saying how her mom doesn't didn't even expect her to graduate high school. She thought, you know, if you just graduate high school, that's that says you know, that's enough. So I was like, you know what, I'm going to do that. I'm going to take this challenge on head on. And so what I did is I took her underneath my wing and I worked with her for a few months. Um, she didn't have any money. Well, we're going to solve that problem. We're going to see if we can figure out that problem together. You know, she has no experience. Well, the course is there. Rise Academy program is there to help her with all of that. You know, every roadblock, the one thing that she needed, I felt was a mentor. And so I acted as a mentor for her. And so she had access only to the same things that I, you know, that every other student that you have had access to, that every other student has had access to. Um, I gave her nothing else outside of what um, you all have access to. The only difference is that I gave her my, my, my leadership, my mentorship, uh, my guidance, my coaching, and uh, lifted her up, gave her cheerleading, gave her whatever she needed, moral support, um, you know, a little kick in the butt, everything that she needed in order to be successful, I offered that up to her. Uh, I did offer to her for free, but this is sort of a trial thing. Uh, but she had to pay for her own way. She had to do all the work. I didn't give her anything that you guys didn't already have access to, um, except for my personal time. You know, I said, the thing is that you need to believe in yourself first. And if you believe in yourself, somebody else will believe in you too, especially if there's somebody out there who loves you, who cares about you, and who would love to see you have an experience, maybe a breakthrough or some kind of life-changing experience, and they believe in you enough 
they may just invest in you and you may be surprised. And she was totally, you know, she didn't believe it. She says, there's one guy, the one person who might, might, might do it, but I don't think they're going to believe me enough. It was her uncle from Mongolia. And she, so she, uh, I think he was on vacation in, in California. And so she had a talk with him and she asked him, she said she was shaking when she sat down to talk to him about it. She was so nervous and afraid to talk to him, but you know, she did it anyway. And by the end of the conversation, and I think a couple phone calls later, <clears throat> after we went back to Mongolia, they made a deal and he gave her the money to get into the program and $3,000 toward her ad spend problem solved. She had the money that she needed. And that alone would be a, an obstacle big enough to prevent most people. All right, jump way forward. Uh, a month later, I believe she made, I'll have to ask her here in a minute, I think she made roughly like 9000 or $12,000 or something like that her first month. And then a month later, she was pulling in upwards of 1000 to $1,100 um, per day. And and I'll ask her some questions and I'll let her tell her story. I'm not, I don't want to like, you know, take away her thunder, but I do, I'm going to ask her some questions here, but that's really it. And my, my takeaway from, from that experience was just that if she can do it, anybody can do it. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get Gigi on here. Um, and let's turn this camera around. Hello, Gigi. How are you? Hello. How are you? Um, so I told everyone your story, more or less, kind of a little bit of a background on you. Um, you're 23 years old, yes. San Diego, California. Um, so tell me a little bit about yourself, um, your background, like where you were before uh, you and I met, um, where your mind was at, where you're, you know, what you were up to in life, and then we can. Well, three years ago, I moved to California. Uh, I, I just started new fresh. I'm from Illinois. I moved to California to begin start fresh. And my point was, I wanted to be somewhere I was comfortable with. So I moved to California and I started college because uh, every one of my friends who are going to college, graduating college, so I wanted to start something. So I went to my first semester of college. It was successful, but I didn't have any inspiring things. I want to do so I had no plans of career wise and one day there was a girl in my class who were telling her story about Facebook she do Facebook online business and she really inspired me but I had no idea how to start the business I had no idea how Facebook get paid give me pay so she's the one who inspired me and a little later after one year I met with Gary Gary was Facebook marketing genius so <laughs> I took this is true <laughs> So uh, that made me inspired, that made me courage to do it because I had someone who was professional, I had my inspired story, I had my goals. So I just spoke to Gary and he told me the basic things. Uh, it's easy, but not that easy. And they, I need you to learn computer skills, technology. I wasn't good at 
computer technology stuff and that put me down so much but Gary's course videos helped me in basic things it was easy to follow I loved how Gary program has everything on videos you don't need to read you don't need to find out to read so I had all these things set up but I had no money and my mom didn't work I had no job so I had no idea how to get the money and I had no credit cards I had no credit score so my limit was really limited so my only option was ask my uncle I asked him it took me a big chunk of guts to ask because I never spoke to him about business so I said why not uh, he's my uncle he loves me he will encourage me he's always encouraged me I showed him uh, Gary's course I showed him the videos I showed him everything needs to prove that uh, this big business could be good for me. Uh, later on, I got my first credit card, <laughs> so I was See? very happy about that. Uh, and I recall, too, where there was a, a phase there where you had money and you were afraid to actually just yeah. take action on it. I had the money, I had everything going. I learned the course in a couple of months. I had no excuse. I was too afraid to start. I was too nervous. I was stuck in the between. That, but I had everything, but my spirits wasn't all in. But Gary talked to me about that. He said a really good thing. He said, you have everything you need. Why are you waiting for? And I said, I'm afraid. I'm afraid of failing. And he said, so what, Phil? Next time when you do something, you have the experience, the guts to do it. Something else, so do it. I want to teach you every step. Uh, you have my course to do it, so why not? I said, why not too? So next day, I ran my first ad and in the 24 hours I sold I saw one cell I didn't even know I saw <laughs> one cell I think I remember that yeah I took a snapshot of like, my Gary what is this yeah. what's this thing with the little dollar sign in front of it yeah. <laughs> and then Gary said congratulations I feel like now I was shocked I was uh, <laughs> like really shocked I was like really and then, you mean I made a sale <laughs> <laughs> yeah so from there on I was like uh, boosting up my encourage my confidence uh, confidence <laughs> I remember, yeah. And then how long did it take you before you remember like what the next week or two looked like for you? Next week I made a uh, week uh, $1,200 something dollar. And your and, first um, paycheck, do you remember what your first ClickBank paycheck was? My uh, first check was 2900 Wow. 
And you were doing what? Somewhere in like two, three hundred percent ROI range. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, just it was amazing. And and again, for me to see that too, I was like, you know, this is what it's all about. Because what I saw in you at that time was like all this, yeah, this newfound courage. You know, you were you were changed. You were like you were like walking around with your your chest, you know, poked out like you were pride. You know, you had a lot of pride. And uh, you know, and I didn't really really talk to you much at that point. I just kind of stepped out of your way. And I was yes. just like, no, just run with it and see where you can take this and I think I think you said you did like 9,000 or some I don't remember what you said the first month you told me when you had your first $1,100 day or something like that right yeah I was so excited I took a snapshot of <laughs> and sent it to her I was like look and he, I was shocked he was see and he was like I'll know it all. I knew you could do it. I knew what you did. So, thank so, you. so tell me, tell me something else here. What did your mom think about you after you explained to her the success that you were having? Because I, I mentioned to to people how in the beginning, you know, your mom was really didn't even expect you. I yeah. mean, you know, she thought if you just graduated high school, that would be you know great. But what? what how did? She, how did her image of you change after she saw what you were achieving? Well, in the beginning, I told my mom I'm going to ask my uncle for the money, and she said, "Nope, this <laughs> I don't think it's a good idea. He will deny you. He will say he will loan you the money, but I don't think so." I was like. Well, let me try first, and then I'll tell you. And then I told my mom, uh, my uncle gave me $3,000, and she, she's like, wow, he, he believes you more than me. And then first week, uh, it was over $1,000 I made. I didn't tell my mom. I wanted to raise that up to 2000 she told my mom, and then next week I told my mom, guess what, I made two thousand more than two thousand dollars. And she's like, you kidding, you joking, <laughs> show me, I, I showed my mom, she's like, is this real money, <laughs> is this online money? This is real money. So I showed my uh, bank account statement, and she was like, "Holy crap! I, I can't believe it. This is real." And then she encouraged me. Of course, she's gonna encourage me after. Then. <laughs> after, <laughs> after the fact. Yeah, after the fact. She's like, "Okay, keep going. You can do it." And then I was like. I love to watch me. And See, look at that confidence. Yeah. <laughs> I told you. Did you ever tell your mom that you made a thousand dollars today? Yes, I, I told my mom I made thousand dollar today. She took a new week. No, and, and just today. She took. Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, needless to say, I mean, I mean, it's got to be life changing for you. Um, I can see it already in your confidence. You know what it's done for your yeah. confidence. I mean, you believe in yourself now. And then later on, um, I need to ask Gary uh, basic stuff, basic questions I wanted to do myself. I research Google watched his video again over and over until I got the point, I got my answers. The bad days, I still had 100 ROI percent, so mm -hmm. I was amazed, I was, I felt top of the world. Top of the world, that's yes. awesome. Well, that's a great story, and thank you so much for sharing that story with with everyone. Let me ask you one one final question. <clears throat> um, do you think that there's value in having a mentor? 
Yes, I do very much. It's mostly encourage uh, we need. Uh, like we are human being. Uh, every second, every minute, we have uh, this feeling of success. One second later, you have one excuse to back down and you go down, down, down until you talk to your mentor and she, they could boost you up so much. And just give you that little extra... Extra boost. Boost, yeah. Well, anyway, it's very impressive what you've done. And I'm very... Thank you. Oh, well, I'm very proud to be part of your life story, and hopefully this will be something that will you'll carry with you. In 10 years later, I'll be right. our number one affiliate market. <laughs> I guarantee you. We'll see about I that. I guarantee you. <laughs> we'll see about that. Well, anyway, thanks again for joining us. Um, hopefully, I'm sure that your story has inspired many and will continue to inspire many people. So thanks so much for joining us. You're Take welcome. care and good luck to you. I hope Bye -bye. you do very, very well. Thank you.